I don't want to single out one country. I don't think there's any problem with relationships with any country as far as uh, this business is concerned, uh, exporting of sand. We have made a blanket uh, uh, decision and it stays that way. Oh, maybe is this mostly because of environmental concerns or because of... It is two things. Logic? One, we have done a study on uh, uh, sand, uh, sea sand exportations, which is mined more than three kilomet uh, uh, kilometers outside uh, uh, the shoreline. Uh, we only allow mining of sea sand even for local use on places where hydrological study has been done by JMG in order to make sure that the seabed is safe for us to extract sand from the, those areas because there is an environmental impact uh, if sea sand is, is, is mined in areas uh, as they like. Uh, we will have to see the uh, continental shelf, the, the photography of the uh, sea base uh, before we allow. So there is uh, 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 studies done by GMG to say where, where along the Malaysian uh, shorelines that you can do sea sand mining. But has there been cases of like illegal mining which led to the decision? Well, illegal mining is ongoing. Uh, uh, we are now uh, have increased our, our patrol and uh, also with the help of the Marine Police and ABBM and, and also from, from my own ministry, from JKPTG, uh, we have raided many ships uh, that has been seen uh, doing uh, illegal mining. We have even confiscated a few ships uh, and this is an ongoing process. Yeah, was good. the ban to stop Singapore from reclaiming land because Singapore is reclaiming so much? Was it because of that as a report? Uh, no, no, there's that? nothing to do with that. Uh, Singapore can always buy sand from other countries who are exporting in, if case, in case they want to do reclamation. Nobody is stopping them. We have no right to stop any country from doing reclamation. As far as we are concerned, uh, it is a collective decision that they, we have done in order to stop uh, sea sand exportation. Hmm. But for Riversand, do we still continue to export to Singapore for Riversand? Uh, Riversand, yes. We Riversand, uh, the, the countries that we, we allow exportation of Riversand is quite clear. Uh, if there's a demand, uh, we will... As it is, silica is exported to Singapore um, uh, because there is a demand for silica sand uh, in the industry. It, it, we, we have no problems in, in allowing our uh, entrepreneurs from Malaysia to export silica sand to Singapore. The ban in place was since last year. Do you know when? And is it how, when? No, we, we start from no, no. The 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 the, the uh, decision made by the cabinet is uh, from the time we took over the government. Oh, since May last year. Yes. That we will stop all export of sand. Yes. Uh, YB, just to clarify, so the decision was it pure, uh, mostly based on environmental concerns? It is main, uh, yes, it's based on environmental con uh, uh, conditions because we did a study and we found out that it needs to be regulated and checked. Right. So uh, currently it's not as regulated as you want it to be? Uh, to a certain extent, no. But at the same time, we are now doing studies and we are regulating it. And we, those who are applying for the sea sand now are all for local use. As you know, we are, we are in, in midst of uh, uh, doing reclamation ourselves. There's huge uh, reclamation going on in Penang, in Malacca. Uh, and so Negri Sembilan had just told me that they are also going to start with the reclamation uh, program uh, along their shores. So all these areas, we need a lot of sea sand. And I think that's enough to go around. So does it mean the current export is zero in terms of season? As far as I know, it is zero. If you know anything else, I don't know, but above me. But as far as I know, it's zero, yeah. Do, do we have an idea of the volume of season produced? Volume? Yeah. I can give you what is the demand. Right. Uh, the, 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 the demand between just uh, Penang, uh, uh, Malacca, will be about 50 million tons of uh, season. Per annum? Uh, well, to just project, but to complete the project, it oh, might go above okay. that as well. What, what about in terms of the river sand, how much exported? Uh, river sand, there's only so far four companies that has been given the license to export river sand. Um, uh, averaging, they all, depending on the capacity uh, of how much they can produce, um, it's uh, less than uh, Two to three million tons, to about two two million tons. And all goes to Singapore? No, 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 no. It doesn't go to Singapore. It goes to China. It goes to India. 
Yeah, it goes to Mauritius, uh, so Brunei, uh, so these are the countries that, that is mainly importing uh, river sand. River sand, there's a big demand for river sand from India, uh, uh, because India is uh, really uh, low on uh, the uh, sand requirement for the uh, infrastructure. So there is a big demand from there. And then our traders are also finding other markets in order to export the river sand. Okay. All right, thank you. Thank you.